Hi friend, this is Summer and we are um, in Advent in December 19th and today we're going to be in Malachi 3 um, and we'll, we will be doing a Lectio Divina of Malachi 3 but it, in order to get ready for that I wanted to share a little piece from Chris Camille's Come Lord Jesus to get us ready for this. Um, in this scripture, Malachi uses a metaphor that most of us aren't familiar with. So I wanted to use Chris's book to teach us um, what uh, Malachi is going to be uh, talking about. He talks about Fuller's soap, using Fuller's soap in order to refine us. Um, so in Malachi's day, in order to prepare and whiten woolen fabric, a fuller stretched the wool across a rock and using a combination of plant, ash, and clay and water, the fuller's soap. Using a rock or a piece of pottery, he would then scrape, mash, and rub this soap into the fibers in order to clean the wool and fill out the fibers. So if God refines us like the fuller soap, then we are the wool in the metaphor, stretched across the rock, doused with water and rubbed hard until we are full with a new and desirable purpose. Thoroughly cleansed of our impurities, by his refining, God makes us useful for the work of his kingdom. So that's a metaphor we're going to be working with today. Uh, before we go ahead and spend time in the Word, go ahead and take a couple deep breaths. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out slowly. Again, breathe in through your nose. And think to yourself, rest. Once again, take a deep breath. And pray with me for our Emmanuel. God with us to come, Lord Jesus, come. We know he's always there, but I believe that we have our hearts shut to him and it's in our becoming aware and inviting him into our presence uh, that opens up that two-way communication of our relationship. So we ask him to come straight into our space to give us an awareness of where he is. Come, Lord Jesus, come. This time, um, just listen and get familiar with the verses. See, I will send my messenger who will prepare the way before me. Then suddenly the Lord you are seeking will come to his temple. The messenger of the covenant whom you desire will come, says the Lord Almighty. But who can endure the day of his coming? Who can stand when he appears? For he will be like a refiner's fire or a launderer's soap. He will sit as a refiner and purifier of silver. He will purify the Levites and refine them like gold and silver. This time
time when you listen, listen for a word or phrase that seems to be important for you. See, I will send my messenger who will prepare the way before me. Then suddenly the Lord you are seeking will come to his temple. The messenger of the covenant whom you desire will come, says the Lord Almighty. But who can endure the day of his coming? Who can stand when he appears? For he will be like a refiner's fire or a launderer's soap. He will sit as a refiner and purifier of silver He will purify the Levites and refine them like gold and silver. Allow that word or phrase to come out between you and the Lord and ask him to look at it with you. This time, listen for an invitation from the Lord. See, I will send my messenger who will prepare the way before me. Then suddenly the Lord you are seeking will come to his temple. The messenger of the covenant whom you desire will come. Says the Lord Almighty. But who can endure the day of his coming? Who can stand when he appears? For he will be like a refiner's fire or a launderer's soap. He will sit as a refiner and purifier of silver. He will purify the Levites and refine them like gold and silver. Allow that invitation to come up between you and the Lord.
Let's pray. Lord, we are addicted to comfortable, even in our relationship with you. And as soon as the pain comes, as soon as the refining comes, as soon as you begin to do your beautiful work of making us shining stars of the kingdom, making us fit for your kingdom, bringing us closer into union with you. We question whether you are good. We can't help it. We are so human. Forgive us, Lord. Help us to trust your hard work in our lives. And that you are always with us, that you love us. through every step of the process. Help us to yield, to surrender. Thank you for it. Plant this seed deep in our heart. Water it, invite us, draw us. In Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Blessings, friend.